Nuggets on the road up three with 320 to play in the half. Poole coming to the rescue. And Jordan Poole. Fourteen for him in the first half. Gordon having a tough time in the offensive end. Poole, the Euro. You didn't know it, Mark. <laughs> But we're having a little pool party this oh, afternoon. Yeah. Not only can he hit shots, he has their range. Mm -hmm. This brother's pulling up from the logo. Pool gets it off. I think Jordan Poole is definitely the most improved player in the league. If you look at where he came from, um, about 55, 60 games into the, to the uh, season last year, he was on his way out of the NBA, essentially. With the 28th pick in the 2019 NBA Draft, the Golden State Warriors select Jordan Poole from the University of Michigan. Jordan Poole was not among the green room invitees, but one of the players in the crowd here at Barclays Center, the former Michigan star. Who I don't see how Jordan Poole cracks more than five or six minutes a game on that roster. But uh, to me, Jordan Poole was not a top 50 prospect in this draft. Yeah, this doesn't make sense to me. I would give it a, a D grade. Okay. Uh, Jordan Poole is a, a fine college basketball player. Might turn into a relevant rotation guy in the NBA, but with so many upside guys on the board. Uh, if you're Golden State, I'd either want to get somebody with more upside or somebody who I think can help me next season. I'm not sure Jordan Poole's either one of those things. Maybe the worst pick in the draft so far. There we go. Uh, and there's nothing against Jordan Poole. No offense, dude. I think the guy could be a rotation NBA player someday. But if you're going to get a guy who can come in and make shots, uh, you're picking a sophomore. You're picking a guy who's you know 20 years old and has some growth to do. Uh, this is a guy that you likely could have gotten as an un as a as an undrafted free agent. So this is such an overdraft. A lot of the older guys have been kind of just giving me a, you know, reassurance that I'm here for a reason. Um, you know, we've been working a lot over the summer and uh, I feel like confidence is something that has gotten me to this point. Shoot that three. Drive, step back, two-pointer. It's good. back door. Um, so just being able to come in and learn as much as I can, especially behind Clay and, and D'Lo and Steph. You know, just to try to, to play an important role, not try to do too much, um, uh, but try to make any impact that I can. I, I feel like I have a, enough confidence to do so. Lock off. Poole's got Plumley on him. Poole gets by him. Step back three. Oh, 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 oh. Oh, a little shimmy, a little step shimmy. You know, this guy was in the G League last year. That was why, I, that was the main reason I voted for him for most improved. He got my number one vote. And my thing is, if you were in the G League last year and now there's finals MVP odds on you a year later, I have to consider you. And, you know, he went down to the G League bubble. He worked. Uh, he put on a performance there and he came back and picked up here, right where he left off in that bubble. And his, and his game, his approach, his attitude has been completely different ever since. And, you know, he's one of them guys now. Jordan, you had a, a pretty big second half of the season. Better pass to Jordan in the corner. And there it is. Just working off of Steph's double team figures. Jordan Poole from DG. He was ready to stop behind it. And it just showed me that the work works. It was kind of you know, just a testament to see that you know, all of the hard work from you know the nine months prior of the pandemic um, was able to show off. Shoot, have to bring it back down, reset, go back up. 
Jordan Poole up and under to finish. Come on now. <laughs> this man is feeling himself. You're fighting over, but you keep coming. Jordan Poole, that little sidestep three. Jordan Poole is fouled shooting that three. And you get a little screen away from Looney. Come off that thing firing. You know, just continue to stay in the routine that I'm in, the rhythm that I'm in, and um, just get better every single day. There were signs that he could be a productive NBA player after some stints against lesser competition, against you know being plugged into lineups that were injured and depleted. There were, there were those signs. And then this yeah. is a whole different thing. I mean, he's gone through a whole journey this season in terms of when should he play? What lineup should we put him in? To all of a sudden now Draymond Green is saying from the podium, this guy's going to have to start. start too. Close by Rivers. Got it. And his speed. His speed. North and south. Once he decides to start. Let every one from the Never let it hate him. There's the sidestep three. Who was our future? You know, the first couple years, you know, I was like, could that be luck? It's only game one. Obviously, we got a lot more games to play, you know, a lot more games to experience, but uh, today was a cool one, and um, got a game in a couple days. Oh, nice little shot fake. So here's Poole. Gordon, he just hit a three on Gordon. This dude really the one. <laughs> I say this boy is the one. Two of the three guards in the game all the time. Oh, what a pass! Half. In terms of Austin Rivers, he told me, oh, we are going to be three and a foul. The Warriors defense than even I am with their offense. Oh, okay. He's really developed his game. Look at that pass. I mean, it's like the dog crawlers out here. You know, coming out of college, you were billed as a catch-and-shoot guy, but obviously it's clear you're a lot more than that. Um, well, has that old, has all, have all these other aspects of your game always been there? And, and you just weren't basically able to show it at Michigan? Yeah. Okay. <laughs> what gave you the confidence that you would be a first-rounder? Um, just being able to, to work so hard on this this particular moment, uh, this opportunity in my life, and I have so much support through coaching staff my family. Um, I just feel like just being able to, to be in this situation, I, I made the right decision. Okay, maybe you'll be a splash nephew now? Yeah, I'm, something like that. I'm definitely a little young, but uh, I'm splash something for sure. <laughs> Might have to bring the drip to the league. There so. we go. Thanks, Jordan. No problem.